Hello everybody, Mike with the Longhorn Classic here. It is Sunday evening, October 27th. We're gonna go over what one of the tracking birds did on this morning's toss, 30 mile toss. Okay, so today's first 30 mile toss, we had a definite problem. Birds trickled in all day. Um, so here we did have a tracker on um, this bird showed up one hour after the first bird. Um, anyway, this is uh, where we let the birds go from Bellevue. Um, so you can see the bird came down. Um, this is buoy right in here is the 20 mile spot. Um, it came down and so it's, it went right over the top of where it's been three times already. Oh, another bird. Okay, so as you can see, the bird went off course because we did have trackers when we did the 20 miles and they basically took this kind of a route. Slight bow, but pretty straight. And those were head, headwinds also. So why this bird all of a sudden took off down here, and like right here, this isn't uh, the bird sitting down anywhere. The trackers are, they're not the best. Um, here, I think there's 90 seconds in between each one. Here, there's like eight seconds or nine seconds in between each one. For some reason, it's just back and forth. So as you see, it comes down here and it does it again right here. All these are 90 seconds, and then it'll do some clumps. Now this is when I was on my way home, but um, going through Decatur there. Anyway, we'll zoom in now in this area and kind of show what's going on, but why the bird did what it did, I really don't know. There's no particular reason or something that shows me that, uh, the reason why it did it. Let's go to the other screen now. Okay, so here we zoomed in. Here's the loft. Um, it's five five miles right here to downtown Alvord. Here's the route the bird came down. So that's about, let's say nine miles off course. Um, the bird continued on down close to Decatur. This went right over the Decatur Airport, which is a small airport. And then it continued on. Uh, well, let me see, that would probably be about 12, 13 miles east. Went north a little bit, then swooped back down. Did this big old circle thing here. And then went and finally made it into the loft about an hour after the first birds got up, the first couple birds came home. So why it did this, I don't know. The winds, uh, there was barely any wind. In fact, it should have been a hand wind. So to have it this far off track, I don't know. These birds, I did see the birds on the way home. And when I hit the uh, 20 mile spot buoy, they were right where they should be and they've been to that spot three times already so hopefully or should plenty of birds come home tomorrow and we'll give them a few days rest loft fly them and get them back uh rested up and we'll get them back on the road